Ready for the truth? The gospel of Jesus Christ is the religion of the African man, not Islam. The sons of Noah, Japheth, the elder, Genesis 10.21, Shem and Ham were all in Shinar, Babylon, Genesis 11.2, not Europe. To this day, the temperature in Babylon is 125 degrees. Their skin was sun-baked dark. The Greeks didn't invade the Levant, Syria to Africa, until 1,768 years after Shinar in 332 BC. And that's when they called the people in that area of the world by their name for dark skin, Ethiopia. Abraham, the father of many nations, Genesis 17:4, was born in Ur, Babylon. The temperature, 125 degrees. Not Europe, fair, pale skin, but Babylon, sun-baked, dark skin. He served other Babylonian gods, Joshua 24:2. But the God of glory appeared to him in Mesopotamia, Babylon, before he dwelt in Haran, Syria, Acts 7 2. Terah, his father, died in Syria at 205 years old. The Almighty God, Genesis 17 1, told Abram, Abraham, to get out of his country, Syria, and go to a land he would show him, Genesis 12 1. Abraham's grandson was Jacob, who was a Syrian, who went into the land of Ham, Egypt. Deuteronomy 26, 5. Psalms 105, 23. Jacob's fourthborn was Judah, and from Judah the Messiah called Christ was born of a woman made under the law. Revelation 5, 5. John 4, 25. Galatians 4, 4. This is the beginning of the gospel of Jesus Christ, the Son of God. Mark 1 and 1. The one faith of God given to mankind, Ephesians 4 5. With the only name under heaven whereby we must be saved, Jesus Christ. Acts 4 10 through 12. In 31 AD, the first century, the Ethiopian from the land of Ham was reading the word of God settled in heaven, authored by the Holy Ghost, written by a son of Abraham, Isaiah, Isaiah 63, 16, from the 53rd chapter at verse 6, reading Holy Scripture settled in heaven, written history proves that we have an Ethiopian, a black man, in the first century, before Islam began in the seventh century, reading the holy scriptures of the first testament, which are authored by God, written by Moses and the prophets. The Ethiopian, black man, is the first to confess. I believe that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. Acts 8.37 He was baptized by Philip who baptized in the name of the Lord Jesus. Acts 8.16 In water between Jerusalem and Gaza and the Ethiopian came out of the water just like our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ did. Acts 8.39, Matthew 3.16. Rabbi disciples do not confess this. Pope disciples do not confess this. They say Jesus Christ is the son of Mary, 
who they call the Queen of Heaven. The Vatican removes Acts 8.37 from Revised Virgin Bibles. History proves that after the Ethiopian returned to the land of Ham with the gospel of Jesus Christ, the Son of God, that in 327 AD, King Asana of Axiom made Ethiopia the first nation to establish the gospel of Jesus Christ, the Son of God, as the state religion of any nation on earth. Armenia is credited as being the first nation to establish Christianity in 301 AD. But Christianity don't baptize in water. They sprinkle in poor water. That's not the gospel of Jesus Christ, the Son of God. Matthew 3.16, Acts 8, 37-39. Islam was created in 601 AD. 579 years after the Ethiopian was converted to the gospel of Jesus Christ, the Son of God. To this very day, 20 centuries after the Ethiopian confessed, I believe that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. And 17 centuries after King Asana made the gospel of Jesus Christ the state religion of the nation of Ethiopia, Israel has never made the gospel of Jesus Christ their state religion. Great Britain or the United States of America has never made the gospel of Jesus Christ their state religion. Rabbi disciples don't follow Jesus Christ. Pope disciples follow Mary, their so-called queen of heaven. Muslims don't believe God has a son. Therefore, the black man's first, last, and everything God is Jesus Christ, the true God and eternal life. Finally, my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge, Hosea 4, 6. The world thinks Jesus Christ, the son of Abraham, who was sun baked dark, was a white slave owner's God. This is false. The largest religion on earth at 1.2 billion people are the followers of the Pope, and they worship the Virgin Mary. Jesus Christ to them is just her baby. Listen to who they pray to. Hail Mary, full of grace. It's a lie. Jesus Christ is full of grace and truth. John 1.14. Islam was the first to take black folks as slaves and still do. The Europeans got it from them. But we are telling everyone to repent and believe the gospel and be saved so that all mankind's faith will be the gospel of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen.